My name is Mariah Hickman, a fourth grader at Paul Lawrence Dunbar Learning Center. And you're watching This Week in Dallas ISD. Woo! 65 of Dallas ISD's best and brightest seniors received nearly $200,000 in district scholarships at the Superintendent Scholarship Ceremony and Reception on Tuesday. The students were recognized for academic excellence at the festive event. Excitement continues to build as students prepare for the two new single gender schools opening next year. The Young Women's STEAM Academy at Balch Springs and Young Men's Leadership Academy at Florence Middle School both have open houses next week, so mark your calendars. The Washington Post ranked seven Dallas ISD schools among the most challenging high schools in the nation. Five of the schools were ranked among the country's 50 most challenging high schools. An ACE school spring mixer provided a chance to celebrate the school's remarkable turnaround this year. Dallas ISD seniors have been named Dell Foundation Scholarship recipients. The students will receive $20,000 in financial support, a laptop, and textbook assistance for college. About 400 fifth grade students from Hillcrest High School's feeder pattern enjoyed team building activities at the AT&T Stadium in Arlington. City Year and AT&T community volunteers completed a service project at Spruce High School on Tuesday. Students at D.A. Halsey Steen Middle School continued their tradition of giving and donated their handmade stuffed character pillows to the children at Genesis Women's Shelter. Now to close this out, here are students at Walnut Hill Elementary dancing to Popsico by Cuckoo Kangaroo. Make sure to check back in next week for more great things happening across the district in This Week in Dallas ISD.